standing here outside the arena where the uh, rehearsals for the big final is in full swing. But we thought we were going to talk a little bit about the uh, order of the songs that were decided yesterday. And it's for the first time it's decided by SVT and not drawn. So um, we're going to talk a little bit about the guys that went uh, for the first and uh, went out first and are going to go out last. So Ronnie, you have two guys with you there, aren't you? Yeah. I'm standing here with a rep representative of France. You might remember him from a few days ago. Hello. Who are you? I'm Frank uh, from EurovisionFR.net. Okay, so France is going out first. What do you think about that? Is that a good position? Uh, it's not a good position. And uh, I said French fans are very upset with this choice. And uh, they, they say that uh, we have completely lose Eurovision this year because of that. But do you, do you think that you did have a real chance of winning before you were handed the first position? Uh, I don't think so. I think we should have been in 15th position. And uh, perhaps the first position in the order of appearance will uh, make it down again. <laughs> okay. Um, and I'm also standing here with a represent representative from Ireland who's going to uh, be the last one to start in, in the competition on Saturday. What do you think about going out w on the last mm. place? Yeah, I think this is the first time Ireland has been last in a final. Uh, it's always good to be last because uh, it's fresh in the memory of the televoters. It's the last song you hear before you vote. It's good. Uh, the running order is important, but the song is more important. I think it does help to be towards the end, but ultimately the best song will win, I think. Yeah, um, is, it a, is it of big importance which, which starting number you have? Uh, I think so. Uh, in the last decade, uh, all songs from the first position uh, go to, to 20, 21, 22nd in the, in the results. So uh, it's very bad of uh, opening the contest, uh, I will say, the, from first to five uh, in the position or order of appearance. So um, it's better to be at the end of the, of the show. Okay, you have both seen the, 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 the starting order now. Which country do you think will win on Saturday? Oh, I think um, there is a role way for Denmark now. And, uh, but there is um, something new in, in the final. If we have two blocks now, we have uh, unsigned uh, USSR and uh, West Europe. Uh, all the Central Europe and Balkans are not in final. And uh, this will, I think, uh, make uh, a, a kind of tie, or perhaps uh, uh, there, will, there won't be uh, too many points between the first and the second. There, there will be a war in the point, uh, I think. Uh, yeah, I think it's going to be Denmark's year. We're staying in Scandinavia, I think. Nice Irish theme in the Danish song this year as well. Uh, where do you think the Balkan points will go? So? Uh, the Balkan points, we, uh, none of the Balkan countries are in the final. Yeah. Where, uh, for whom do you think they will root for and w vote for? Perhaps for uh, ex-Soviet uh, re Republic, in fact, uh, so Ukraine, uh, Georgia, Azerbaijan or Russia, of course. And uh, I think uh, Western Europe will vote for Scandinavia. Mm. Okay. I think the Balkan votes will go to Greece. I think Greece will pick up a lot of votes from the Balkan neighbours. So we will have more alcohol on Saturday? Yes, we will. Unfortunately, it's not free here, but hey, <laughs> it will be cheaper in Denmark next year. What? Don't you think it's free here? <laughs> what are you implying? <laughs> no, alcohol is very expensive here. <laughs> not as expensive as Norway, but yeah. <laughs> well, we might go back to Nor. We might go back to Norway next year. Who, who knows? Will you go then? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Anywhere in Scandinavia, fantastic. But you will bring your own alcohol then? Yes. Duty free for Norway, remember? Yeah. Not the EU. <laughs> thank you so much, guys, and good luck for your thank countries you, on Saturday. Thank you. Thank you.